Hello everybody and welcome to the beauty series. Today I decided to talk about a point of roses massage in more detail since I mentioned it in my videos quite often. When you start working on your face, try to recover muscle structures, you usually tend to underestimate the initial reasons of structure deformations. And if you don't eliminate it all, the results you get will not last long. Your skull is covered by interconnected muscles, those are forehead, temple, muscles and tendons. State of those muscles directly influences the way your face looks. Moreover, with years, scalp grows together with the skull. When your face scalp is attached, it doesn't move, it creates pressure on your upper part of your face. This way, horizontal lines are formed when you lift your eyebrows due to the fact that your skin is attached and cannot move anymore. Tension in all of your face tissues changes because of that. Lack of normal circulation in scalp area provokes swelling, formation of droopy eyelids and horizontal lines, generally makes your face less fit and taut. That's why a ponderosis massage is something you really need. It improves blood circulation which provides your skull with all nutrients, making them more flexible and preventing from shrinking. And when you move your scalp from the skull, you separate them, preventing from growing together. And the good bonus for that is stimulation of hair growth. So let's dive into it. Starting with a light massage, working through your head in soft motions without putting a lot of pressure. Continue massaging for one minute. After that, move on to softening of your opponent roses. Put your hands on your head and start moving your skin apart from the skull bones. Try to really separate them from one another. You can continue massaging in different directions, working through the temple zones. Moving to the back of your head. You can also grab your hair and separate the skin from the skull in that way. Don't forget to work through the area behind your ears, same way moving your skin apart. And move on to the temples. Stick your palms to the temples and massage in circular upwards motions. Moving on to the forehead. Stick your fingers to your forehead and con continue separating the skin from the bones of your skull. During this exercise you should avoid any rubbing motions. Finish off this exercise with smooth massaging motions. You can do this complex whenever and wherever you want, but please remember to do everything very consciously and paying attention to your body and your feelings. You should increase intensity of the exercises very gradually. If you found this video interesting, subscribe to our channel, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.